for his first out since May 7th. Well, fortunately for Velasquez and the winning Breeders' Cup handicap, a grade two event. We'll look to post victories in back-to-back -back grade two races here today. Well, now it's going to come down to how the race unfolds, and you heard it first. Mike Mitchell saying, I think they're going to give us a clear lead with the four Leprechaun Kid. Let's see if Tyler Bays and Leprechaun Kid can control the early stages of the Del Mar handicap. Have them, the ten with the before the nine. have them get behind the nine with the buggy whip, Junior. So they've put a blindfold over Seraphan. He has a, a couple of problems, mentally that is. Well, this is something they have done before, and uh, let's see what happens with the 10 Seraphan. You can see him, just a little bit of nervous sweat there, but again, you're talking about an eight-year-old making his 49th lifetime might start. Have to crack on the He's fine. If you don't go in, there you go. I'll wait for you to get your blindfold off, Zane. Still got two out yet, guys, two out. All right, I'll wait for you to get your shank off. Take your shank off, kill when you get in. I'll wait for you. Set now for the Delmar. All right, get your shank off. Still got a shank on, boys. All right, boys, let's go. Feel sent on their mile and three-eighths journey. They all came away perfectly. Leprechaun Kid wants the early lead, and Leprechaun Kid immediately goes off to show the way. Laura's Lucky Boy is getting up to race in second. Kilkia Castle third, then it's Continental Red. Out of here is back in the fifth position. Down at the rail is Runaway Dancer, who's giving the leader a good 10 length start as he goes away up front. Then comes Exterior, Sarafan back third last, always first to second last, and continuously the trailer. Top of the lane, first time round, and Lepra Corn Kid. Not in that big a hurry, but he's opened up a nice lead here. He's clear of Laura's Lucky Boy in second, who in turn is a good six lengths in front of Kilkia Castle in the third spot. Then Continental Red, out of here, Sarafan Grandstand side, Runaway Dancer scraping paint. Alongside exterior back third last. Then we come back to always first and continuously last. A good 18 lengths would cover them all. Past the seven eights they go, and Leprechaun Kid could not have it more his own way out here. He's going along clear by four, and they've covered almost half the journey now. Laura's lucky boy is second, then a big gap of six lengths back to Kilkia Castle third. Continental Red and out of here a joint fourth. They followed by exterior. Down at the rail is Runaway Dancer, is a good 15 off that leader. Always first is the first one to start making progress on the outside. Continuously a second last, and Sarafan been eased. Number 10, Sarafan, has been eased out of the race. They have a half mile to go in the Del Mar handicap, and Leprechaun Kid still going comfortably. Kia by four and a half lengths to Laura's Lucky Boy. Then we come back to Kilkia Castle in third. Now they're starting to come after the leaders. There goes continuously out of here. Continental Red always first to starting his run on the outside in the blue. Then it's exterior. Runaway dancers last. They come into the top of the lane. Does Leprechaun Kid have anything left? He certainly looks like he does. He goes on. But now here comes Laura's Lucky Boy. And Laura's Lucky Boy making a massive run as they come to the top of the lane. Laura's Lucky Boy up alongside a Leprechaun Kid. Continental Red third, homeward bound now, and Laura's lucky boy strong on the lead. Leprechaun Kid all hearty comes right back at him. Laura's lucky boy, Leprechaun Kid in a thriller. Leprechaun Kid came back and owes to Laura's lucky boy. Exterior and Continental Red in a photo for third.